Outside Charlton with me here. Um, it's Friday the 29th, 29th of October. Of October. Yeah, just gone 9 o'clock in the morning. Um, we're just getting ready to go out. We had breakfast in the room ourselves. We brought it with us. Slept really well, didn't we, Chaz? Pretty much, yeah. yeah. The room was nice and cold. It's a nice aircon in here. It's just lovely, right up my street. Do you like it, boys, or is it a bit cold? Mm, I liked it. Yeah, I liked it. But the bed weren't too bad. Just a bit small, I suppose, compared to when, when you're used to a bigger bed. But um, yeah, today we are doing going to Oxford Street first, um, and then we're doing the London Eye um, just after 12.45, I think. I think it's 12.30. 12.30. Um, and then after that, we are going to Madame Two Swords, because I haven't been there for years. The boys have never been. So that should be good fun, shouldn't it? Yeah. And then we've got dinner tonight at the Brew Dog at Chancery Lane, because um, we pretty much couldn't get in anywhere else, could we? So um, that should be good because we like that. We enjoyed that in Bath, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, and that'd be better than dinner last night. The bat, bat and ball. That was all right, wasn't it? Yeah, it was all right. Chicken but wings were a I bit rubbish. Like no. We wanted buffalo sauce on our chicken wings, yeah. but we like didn't it. get no buffalo sauce. Yeah, fourteen quid for ten chicken wings was a bit of a rip. I thought when they didn't really come with anything. We thought they were going to be covered in buffalo sauce with a blue cheese dip, but they weren't. They just came plain wings with two tiny little pots of blue cheese sauce. My hot dog was alright. The blue cheese sauce was really nice. Yeah, blue cheese sauce didn't really taste the blue cheese either. Yeah, you um, didn't really taste it. No. So that the, the hot dog was alright. Um, the pizza was alright, wasn't it? Yeah. And pizza drinks, was actually delicious. Yeah. And the drinks were amazing the as well. The drinks were lovely. I had a lovely pint of It's only really the wings, town. But... Yeah. And it was just really loud, really, in there. There's a lot of people just drinking beers in there, weren't there? And very loud music. Swearing. We probably should have gone somewhere else with the kids, really, shouldn't we? Maybe I really liked it. Yeah, yeah. It, it was nice. Um, yeah, but today, don't know what we're going to do for lunch. We'll find something. Mm, snacky thing. Snacky something. Um, yeah, and we'll take you along with us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we just arrived on Oxford Street, yeah. went to go to Night Town, and doesn't open till 11, so um, we're just wandering down to Sports Direct for the boys. Yeah, and it's like this new Sports Direct that's opened, it's got, I think it's got like three floors or something. Yeah. Um, and it's got this area where you can test out football boots. Yeah. And stuff. So it's cool. And then they have a shop in the uh, basement of it. Ooh. Oh,
So, we just had a little Starbucks straight, didn't we? Yeah. What'd you have it? Caramel latte. Caramel latte in a standard old Starbucks. We're just next to Liberties of London. And luckily we were indoors because it started tipping it. They were rain, didn't it? Yeah. But, um, yeah. There's a cool shop down there and we're looking for the NBA shop. Yeah, we're going to go and find the NBA shop, which I think is just down here. Off Great Marlborough Street, which is just off Carnaby Street. So, yeah. So um, we're just going to walk down here now, aren't we? station just getting ready to go towards the London Eye just got to get something to eat first how are you dudes Good. you had to get too hot in your mask didn't you yeah such an impressive station Wow, how cool is that Chaz? And look what's over here Charlie. What is Big Ben? It's the bell inside of it. Yeah, so it's not actually the tower. Yeah. The House of Parliament. This is Westminster Bridge. Charlie, where are we? We're at 
We just got in, we just got something to eat because uh, we're a bit peckish from this place. So our, our flight is due at 12.45 and it's now 12.27 so um, I don't think we can join the queue until then. Sure, there used to be a McDonald's around here before, but yeah, just waiting to get on. No McDonald's. No McDonald's, no Mackies. So we've just bought a cross on just before we go and get on to the London Eye, which will be awesome. It's absolutely massive. You forget how big it is when you see it on telly. But these suspension cables here holding it up in the ground. The tension must be amazing. Very busy around here. I guess it's always busy. Even with the weather a bit rubbish. Charles is chasing pigeons in his brand new shoes.
scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Christ. I saw him move and I was waiting. He was waiting for you to come out. Oh no. I saw him move. Boys, give it a verdict. I think you better get the wipes out, Johnny. Yeah. <laughs> it's hot. It's hot, is it? Yeah. They are hot. Are yummy? Yes. Yummy? Yeah. Yummy noises. Mm. <laughs> Hello 
Hello there. <laughs> uh, just filming a bit of an outro for today. We um, are knackered. We're back. We were back in the room by what time? Just after eight o'clock. Just after eight o'clock because uh, we were so tired and we'd done everything. Um, but um, we had a lovely meal at Brew Dog. It was good. Really nice. A lot of boys were the only kids in the restaurant. We should have known that. We should have booked something else um, sooner. But we were worried about booking stuff with COVID. And then when we did book stuff or try to book stuff we couldn't do. Um, and everything was like sold out. So um, it was good that we could actually book somewhere for them to eat. Rather than just like a fast food chain. Um, and the food was really good. The service was good. Um, the location was good for us, wasn't it? So it was nice. Well, can I say something? Yeah, you can say something. Um... About where we went, where Madame Two Swords is. Yep. They, they have some really cool restaurants there. If you're just looking for a snack, they have like a Taco Bell, Chipotle, Dunkin' yep. Donuts. Yep. And then they have like um, chicken places, KFC. We yep. went to McDonald's, didn't we? We did. We had twenty nuggets for a snack. Um, Not each. I could do 20 by myself, to be fair. But um, yeah, not each. We shared a 20 box. I could probably do 10. Yeah, easy. Um, but Madame Two Swords was superb, weren't it? Yeah. Really enjoyed that. The London Eye was good, apart from the queue. Queue took 45 minutes, if not longer. A bit longer, I think. An hour. Yeah. Yeah, it took an hour. yeah, probably an hour. So our, our posted time was 12.45, and by the time we actually got on the ride was, yeah, probably... It was one. It was one one forty-five when we got. Yeah, probably an hour to get on the ride. So take that into account if you're doing it. Um, but it was it was good. Um, not much social distancing going on on that. Security was massively disappointing. They literally waved a metal detector around you. Didn't. And I had my phone in my pocket, my wallet in my pocket, my camera in my pocket. They scanned them over, run the metal detector over them. Didn't ask me to turn my pockets out at all. You know, could have had anything in there. Um, and she just said to me, yeah, can you put your bag through the the um, scanner thing? Like an airport scanner. But nobody was checking that I actually did that. I could have just literally walked on with it. So it's quite poor, I thought. Did they you? did stop. Mm. They stopped some people in front of us for having alcohol, didn't they? They did stop, yeah, because they actually put their bag through the scanner and found yeah. alcohol. But... Um, if you literally could have walked on without it. So that's quite questionable, the security around London Eye, I'd say. But um, yeah, it was good once you are on, weren't it? Yeah, it was. There weren't much social and distancing, like I said. because it goes so slow. Yeah. Hardly anyone wore a mask. Um, social distancing weren't really a thing on there at all. Um, the tubes, I'd say less than 50% of people wear a mask. Wouldn't you? Yeah, probably 25% wear masks. Yeah, and they've got signs up everywhere saying that masks are mandatory. I appreciate it's not law anymore, but um, on the TFL it says that you're supposed to wear a mask and no, nobody really bothered. Um, I think Madame Two Swords is yep. uh, the, the best thing that we've done. Yeah, Madame it Two was, Swords was awesome. Yeah, it was really good. But some of, the, some of the things that even you said that, like... Some some of them look exactly like them, but some don't. Yeah, some look exactly like them. Um, uh, Others didn't. Yeah, like Harry look. Harry and Meghan. Harry looked just like him, and Meghan did not look no. like her. Um, Mohammed Salah in a white suit. Yeah, because they couldn't put him in his kit, could they? No. He might switch teams. He was cool. Um, Bobby Moore looked brilliant. Pele, Ronaldo. Pele looked good. The Rock. Anthony Joshua was massive. The rock was good. The rock was massive. It was good. Um, yeah, we had a fantastic day, and um, I think I've walked. Let's have a look. Seven miles, she said. I think. Yeah, fifteen thousand three hundred one steps, seven miles today. So quite a distance. Jasmine snacker, didn't you? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So we've um, been and bought some pastries from Marks East to have in the room tomorrow for yeah. breakfast. And I think we're going to do a little bit of shopping around Westfield and then yep. head home. Oh, we've treated ourselves to a Starbucks London mug, which is cool. Um, what else did we buy? Chazzy bought some Lego yeah. to do. I've bought a couple of t-shirts. Cool. Eddie's bought a t-shirt. Yeah. I bought a t-shirt. 
Chasman bought some trainers I'll tell today. Them, tell them where we went um, this morning. We went to a really cool Sports Direct. Yeah, I filmed some in the big Sports Direct on Oxford Street, which was cool. Yeah. It was really good. I had a lovely trip. We're going to do a bit of shopping tomorrow, so um, we'll do a bit of filming then as well. But tonight is done. We are cream crackered. The night. <laughs>